Have a look. No, thank you. Oh, no, I want to talk to you. Come no, thank on. you. If you keep coming towards me, I'll defend myself. Stay back. Defend yourself. Stay back. Defend yourself. Let's try it. I'm Let's try it. Stay Coastal back. Coastal I'm telling Coastal. you now. Stay back. So, welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we're here in London, an NW10 postcode, taking a look at Garden Studios. Now, you may not know it, but this year's Big Brother is located in a warehouse on an industrial estate. You wouldn't have thought it, would you? But right next to a fire station, here in, well, on Waxlow Road. All right. Yes, thanks. Need some help? Oh, what are you offering? Well, it uh, will be good. I might be able to help you, I might not. Oh, uh, I weren't expecting any um, cooperation. I'm just making a video from the outside. Okay. I'm an industrial estate YouTuber, so just the fact that you've got this set on an industrial estate, oh, okay. it comes into my niche market. No and what I do, hold on, what I do, I take the drone around, I get some aerial footage on every single video that I make, I tell the viewers what I can see from the outside, and then I'll be gone. 20 minutes, I'll be gone. Okay, okay, no worries. All right. Thank you. So, Garden Studios, yes. As shown on Google Maps right now, this was just an empty warehouse with a, a security guard on the gate and all of a sudden boom it's the set of big brother but as i said look you wouldn't have thought it would you we've got some porter cabins in the yard they've tried to put some privacy screens up but it's right next to a 5g mass look look at that how awesome is that so we'll have the uh, the normal outside tour See what we can see, all right. Cadent gas. There's no smell at all from that, is there? Is it live? You're positioned here quite, for quite a long time each day, yeah? yeah. What do you do then? Just checking that it's uh, not giving off anything it shouldn't, my friend. Yep, you're okay there. Safe as house is there, my friend. So this is 21 Waxlow Road. And we've got Sunset Crew. Must be a code name. Strictly no tailgating. So every single person has to swipe in and out so they know exactly who's in there. Yeah, don't worry, I'm not coming in. I'll just stay outside. The drone will go in in a bit just to see what you got at the back, but I won't. The drone will be my eyes today. Well, the drone's not a problem, is it? Yeah, it might be. Now's your opportunity to talk to me about it. Yeah, someone's coming out. Oh, someone's coming. All right. No problem. <laughs> So we've got the site across the road as well. So that's or is it orchid or orchid? I'm not sure. It's got a H, so I'll say orchid. Have you never had to say the word? No. So orchid, stage one, across the road at number 14. 
and stage two and three over here at 21. Did you get a lot of following? Uh, let's just see how it's um, handled first before I get too friendly with you. Because oh. they might all come out and say, go away or whatever, you know. And here's me being friendly with you and I'll regret it, won't I? <laughs> I'll tell you at the end, yeah? Runner number five. I couldn't quite see what his laptop said. He had it open, but he didn't have it open quite enough. Look at the zoom on this one. Look at that. Can even read her ID. Read the privacy, no? It's out in public, isn't it? She's not. She's not covered it. Yeah. You've got to be prepared. What do you think paparazzi do? With their zoom cameras, what do you think the paparazzi do? This is exactly this. You don't have no privacy in public, mate. That, you ever seen them um, zoom in on the Prime Minister's paperwork and the budget, you know, that red box? Next thing you know, it's all leaked over the news, what he had in his paperwork. <laughs> Hello, are you filming? Yeah, I'm filming. What for? Just YouTube. Just a YouTube, YouTube creator. Oh, uh, okay. Cool. Are you, what, are you wanting to get something particularly here or...? Um, what I normally do, I focus on industrial estates, so not oh. specifically for... Okay, fine, um, not and, for the studios. Well, I am. Yeah. Because you've located yourself in an industrial estate, it's in my niche. Okay. So there's certain things that I do on every video, and yeah. I'll just be following the same format. Okay, what, what's your page? What are you offering? Are you offering... No, I'm not offering, I'm just... Oh, right, I'm just, okay, being nosy. Yeah, like me, yeah. I'm being nosy on your site, you're being nosy. Yeah. Um, I told him I will tell you the page at the end. Yeah. I will tell somebody, but yeah. not yet, because I've not yeah. really... Um, we're still getting people asking me questions. I don't know how professional you guys are yet, so well, let's well, not get too friendly. Well, I look after the press, you see. That's oh, do you? I'm asking, yeah. I'm okay. the press for the programme, so right. that's why I was asking. Yeah, there's certain, as I said, there's certain things that I look at and highlight on every video. And one of them yeah. is um, the SIA licence, a blue badge that they have to display by law. I can't see these two wearing it just yet. Um, you do have one, yeah? Mm -hmm. What's this? Yours is visible, yours is not. It just has to be on display by law. Yeah, but listen, yeah. Hold on, I'm talking. Listen. See, to, see, yeah, see what I mean? We're getting there, aren't listen, we? Listen. True colours. You, you need to be calm, yeah? You can't just come, come to don't, the side. You don't tell me what I need to be doing, people. mate, on a public you footpath. You people around. Yes, if I you can. That's illegal without no permission. You're joking. You really. And yes, I have taught you that. Yeah. That it's you illegal to film people. You see what? You this is not doing any good for PR. <laughs> she was doing all right, you should have left Easy. it to her. Listen, my friend, I can film anything from the public footpath. I do this all the time, including you, including her. If I don't give permission, you, 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 you can't video me. I don't, I don't need that. You don't I need don't, that? I don't want to be in your, in your media space. Well, what have you come over here for then? Because I just came to talk to you. You are in the video. At the moment, you're the star of the show. You've spoke to me the most. You will be put on YouTube. If you're capturing me without my permission, yeah. listen. Yeah, I'm it's listening. Not a, it's not a joke. Don't, don't put me on your, on your footage. Is that a threat? Me. You can't come to people's site and, and be doing what you're not meant to be doing. That's in your opinion, not meant to be doing. Where you got that from? You listen, make it, are you making it up? Listen, listen. I'll be trying to be polite with you. Get me? You can't just come to people's space. That's your opinion. And, and, it's not the law. And be videoing randomly. Mm -hmm. I saw you capturing people when I, when I was telling you that you were even capturing me. I'm recording right now. I'm zooming right in. I can go all the way down there. And this is what I do on every single video. You're coming out here on a public footpath trying to dictate to me what I can and cannot do. It's not even backed up by law. Are you if, making it up or if, what? If you're in a public footpath, you, you, you are not aligned to be zooming people. Get me? You, you can't be wrong. zooming me. You're wrong. If you, if, if you go to the notice, the notice that we put outside, if there's a notice there that if you, you have to sign, sign, sign like, like, like a permission before you, you can be on the footage. I don't know what planet you're living okay. on, my friend. So good for you. Good for me. Why don't you just uh, 
get back on your site and get to back go. to work. I'm, I'm, I've spoken to you, but I'm telling you right now. I'm finished. I don't want to be on your footage, you get me? I'm I telling you, you there. are on the footage. You've walked in to my film set. I was here filming, you've walked into it. If you don't want to be on it anymore, back to work. I'm going to carry on on the public footpath doing my video in peace, please. And you're breaking the law. No SIA license on display. Do do that? That's not your business. Oh, you, what you, am you, I doing? Got, what I'm doing is your business, so, yeah? Listen, so why are you concerned about his SIA license? He, he's got his SIA license. I've just told license. the lady on every single one of my videos, I make sure certain things are complied so it's not with. It's not your business because I was even, even more calm to you to show you my SIA license. You can't be asking anyone if, if he's got his SIA license. Watch this. It's none of your business. Watch this. Where are you going? I don't know what you, whatever you're showing me. I don't care. This is the .gov.uk yeah. website. Look, look how rude he is. The oh. .gov.uk website. You must wear your SIA license where it can be seen at all times. Yeah, he was in, he was going in. No, he wasn't. He you're a liar. You're, I'm glad I didn't tell you the channel because you're a liar. Why don't you just slot it in there, you're put it on liar. display and comply with we'll the law. Ignore, this guy. ignore you. That's what I should have done in the first place. I've told you, if you put me a footage, Think because we're here. Listen, my friend, you don't intimidate me. Whatever you have to say doesn't bother me, okay? You are not the boss of me. Just remember that. I don't know. Oh, we're looking after you there. I was checking to see if this has given off any harmful gases or radiation. Because you know what this is, don't you? You don't even know what it is, do you? Oh my God. All right, okay. Right, anyway, let's carry on. I don't know uh, who these guys are employed by, but so far, not so good, I'm afraid. They should have left it to the lady from PR. <laughs> so we have got a footpath closed sign. So that's good. This will have had council approval to close that. We've got some portable toilets. So the number of people working here is slightly higher than toilet capacitor. And then we have Iris stage one. Down here with some more privacy screening on the fence. We've got some sort of outbuilding there with grass on the roof. I'll try and get a look at that with the drone. But yeah, garden studios. You can see that this has got a, uh, a cutout. This is a door of some sort. It's well hidden. And we have got some signs. I won't go in there. I'll just use a zoom. Filming is taking place in this area. Right, okay. If you enter this area, you may be captured on film. So this might be the entrance for launch night, eviction night. I'm not sure. Hello there, how, how are you? You good? Hey, what are you doing? Sorry? What are you doing? I'm just walking around. Is that all right with you? Public footpath? Well, I don't know yet. <laughs> I don't know yet. I'm, I'm, yet, I'm yet to decide on that one, my Public friend. Okay. And here we have sunset. Strictly no access. Please report to main reception. Hello? So they're using the PMR frequency as well. This gate is alarmed, strictly no entry. And then down there is the dead end. Got some antennas at the top. Looks like they've been here a long time. But yeah. What did you think of him, eh? We've got two radios. I've got the frequency of one of them. Panic stations, look, panic stations. So it looks like they occupy 
all the units down the end here apart from Royal Mail and I've not checked that one yet because over here we've also got Garden Studios through the window lock. So this is one of them. This is one of those places where they tend to think they own the place, but they certainly don't, do they? As shown just there, Royal Mail have got access to the bottom. And we've also got a few other businesses in this bit here. Tappy Carpets. That's all us there. There's a lot of intimidation tactics at the moment, trying to scare me off. I don't think so, do you? I do not think so. Is there anything I should know? Because you're acting very shady. Just as shady as you. Any concerns that no, you want to talk about? No? no? Concerns about. Okay. Right. Well, at least I've made an attempt, yeah, that's to all, communicate. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. So, that's I, fine. I don't know what's going on, but... You tell us what you're, what's going on with you, then. I've told your colleagues. I'm here to make a video about the place for my YouTube channel. They're uh, in-house security. Yeah, then. Oh, they're not. So they're two different types of people. Should we start again then? Well, we can start I'm a YouTuber. Again. I'm an industrial estate YouTuber. I've not, I've not been in this area before. It just so happens this is the Big Brother set. So it's, it's in my niche, my little niche market that I've got on YouTube. So I'm just making a video. All my videos include a drone shot going around, but I won't go no lower than roof height. Simple as that. Drone shots, yeah. The drone will be going around at the end of my video. I'm just having a look what Ollie I can see. Security. Stand, stand, by, stand, stand by. by. I'll be there, thank you. I'm just seeing what I can see from the public footpath. Any objections? It's a public footpath. Yeah, the drone? The drone will be, but... Go on, I'm listening. It's uh, a nice public footpath. You can do anything in the air, but so, where you fly the drone is, you know, not... You can, I'm saying over the show when people yeah. are out, we have to look into that one. Yeah, I've got a great zoom on the camera anyway, so if there is crowds of people, then if I feel the people cannot move out the way if my drone fell, then I won't go over them. So I'll just go around the outside and use the zoom. Right. But it's an amazing place and it's going to be a great video for me. And I, I told your guy down there, I'll give you that at the end. Because if I give it you now, it might affect things. You might look at what, how many subscribers I've got and stuff like that. If it's, if it's a lot, you might treat me different to if it was less. You get what I'm saying? It influences decisions along the way. So I'll tell you that at the end. Why can't you tell us now? I've just told you. It might influence your decision of how you, what, how you behave. Because say like if it had millions, you might come out and say, actually, while you're here, come on, let's be nice to you. But do you know what I'm saying though? That's my, that's my experience. So that's why I don't give it too soon. All right. Okay, guys, so we've got over that little hiccup that we had there, so I'm going to carry on, all right? So, what you said, what, so you're going to fly the drone again, are you? I've not done it yet. Why, well, you had a report that I've done it already? I'm just asking the question, you're going to fly, are you going to fly the drone again? Again? I've not done it yet. Right, okay. I will be flying it. Every, the drone gets put up at the end of every video, so nothing changes on my format. Right. Okay. And your name is, sorry? I'll give you that at the end. What can you say now? I've just explained. If I give it you too soon, the name is my YouTube channel. So you'll be able to see who I am. If I've got n no following, you might treat me different to if I've got millions. We're rolling now. Everything that happens. Everything that happens. Hiya, can you pop into the diary room and take a the rest of the other crime? The diary room? Yeah, copy that. Thank you. Wow. We've actually uh, got a frequency for the, uh, the staff inside. <laughs> They're talking about the diary room. What's it like? What's it like having Big Brother there? I don't understand English, sorry. Oh, <laughs> I asked the next person. <laughs> yes, yes. English? Yeah. Polski? Polski too. Oh, I don't, I don't know Polski. You like Big Brother? You like Big Brother? And I'm just saying, um, since Big Brother have been here, has, has the area changed? Can everyone please remain off comms? No we're new here. We can everyone like, please remain like, off comms now? Two, Thank no, you. One month working you can oh, ask him. You can ask him. I have already, yeah. yeah. Oh, really? Give him an interview. Oh, I'm and sorry. You realise Big Brother TV friend? show is here, yeah? Uh, I think so. Maybe I think so. There is a stage one. 
you can now sing. Thank you. Have a nice day. So you can hear them um, asking everybody to stay off comms. They finally realise that they're broadcasting on a, a public frequency and everybody can hear them. <laughs> oh dear, like a circus, isn't it? I've got one following me here. SRM. My friend, S oh, you don't want to talk, do you? What does SRM stand for? Oh, you're one of them, are you? Yeah, but come on, and be nice to you. So that's not making SRM look good, is it? I don't need to tell you anything, do I? Well, is that how you treat members of the public, just showing an interest then, is it? Not really, I don't need to tell you anything. Am I forcing you to? I'm not going to ask where you got your shoes from. You tell I'll tell me. you. Do you yeah, want to look at them? Tell me. I don't need to tell you. Yeah, I'll come and talk to you about my shoes if you want. I like talking to people, that's all. No, I'm all right, mate. I don't need to talk to anyone. You don't need to? No, I don't want to. Oh, I don't want to, that's a different matter. There you go. I don't need to and I don't want to. All right, mate, no worries. I'm going to leave you alone now because I can tell it's a bit uncomfortable, isn't it? Oh, well, we could have, we could have spoke, but obviously you don't want to. So. What do you want to talk about? What is that show? Sure? SRM. What is it? What is it that you do? I work. Yeah. What's it stand for? Does it stand for anything? No. Okay. I'm the nurse. All right. I'm the initial. All right. There, so you can sort of sense the uh, <laughs> the level of professionalism, can't you? You don't need me to tell you what the atmosphere is like here at the Big Brother set. So anyway. That's the ground tour. We've been up, we've looked at every sign, we've come down, we've got some staff leaving now. Polski. Polski? Polski? Oh, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> uh, so, from this point here, we've got a great wide line of sight. We'll get David up and we'll see what this place looks like from above. So as always, we've checked on drone assist. There are no flight restrictions in this area. All we've got here is some sort of light show, uh, search light display. That might relate to the strobe lights that are pointing up in the sky, you know, mainly for hot air balloons, helicopters maybe, but it certainly does not stop a drone flight. So, Garden Studios. Let's have a look at you then, shall we? Go ahead. Where is your location? I am just by um, the stage uh, door. So up at 50 meters high, I did suspect it all to be happening in this car park here but I was wrong so it must be over at that door where the guy came out in a rush Have a look No thank you Oh no I want to talk to you Come No thank on. you, if you keep coming towards me I'll defend myself, stay back Defend yourself Stay back Defend yourself to Let's, the try Let's try it. Let's try it. Stay back. I'm telling you now. Stay back. In, That's what I look for. Like. No. Look. No. How can I look? Hey, thank you for letting me know. How can I look? You've been warned. Yeah, I'm sorry. Keep your distance. Look. If you come too close, I'm telling you now. No, you're in your personal space. You want to have a look what you're looking at. I'm and I tried to be nice to you I'm earlier. Nice to you. What's happening to you? I'm talking. I tried to be nice to you I'm earlier. Nice I'm to you. talking. I'm rude. rude. I'm rude, but we're having a chat now. I tried to Can talk to you nicely earlier. And you dismissed me. You, you was said, rude to me, so I'm being rude I'm to you. Rude to I'm giving you back what you gave to me. I, I don't want to talk to you anymore. Fine. Zip no it. Worries. Don't need to tell me to zip it, mate. That's being rude. I'm I don't want to talk to you anymore. Zip it. Don't need to zip it. Don't tell me to zip it because I can do what I want on a public street. If you want to play that game. And this is the level of professionalism from the no worries. the casting. Well, are we, are we calling you the crew? What are you? Uh, are you a runner? Can you please not film me? Get, get don't stuffed. Don't give you permission to film me. Get stuffed. Don't give you permission to film me. Get stuffed. Go away then. Nope, don't give you permission to film me. Go away then. Nope, don't give you permission to film me. Can you turn the camera off? Please? No, I will not. Don't give you permission to film me. Don't care. Well, you're being rude now. I was being nice and I don't want you to film me. Now you're being rude. Well, so let the viewers care. decide if you was being nice or not. No worries, mate. I'm just asking you not to film me. Pol uh, politely declined please. your request. Politely declined. No worries. 
So we can clearly see there. Let's make sure our onlooker doesn't see what we're looking at. Oh, no, no. You can see the depth between the the wall where they'll be walking around the outside with the cameras, etc. Nice and dry. You can see how it all works. And that would be the stage that we saw on launch night just there with all the speakers around. And they've even got a bit of a lighting boom. What drone is it? Over the canal. Don't interrupt a, a drone pilot, my friend. Oh, it's, uh, it's, it's not a nice thing to do when you interrupt a pilot. Oh, sorry, I didn't know that. I don't know. I'm not used to people flying drones, so I'm asking. Don't want to talk to you until the drone's down. So you can see how the garden connects with the house there. So the main house is actually inside the warehouse unit, which has got solar panels on it, look. So on launch night, they'll all come through this gate here, which is quite thick to be fair, on top. I think they're trying to make it hard for people uh, to get in. You know, we had the Alley Law incident years ago where they managed to gain entry, caused a bit of... I'm just flying the drone, and um, just give me two minutes and I'll bring it down, then it's safe to talk. Okay. Okay. So we'll just get nice and high. We'll show you what's uh, around the vicinity. So it backs onto a, a canal or a river. I think that's a canal. But it's nestled amongst lots and lots of warehouse units including Royal Mail at the bottom, as we saw earlier. And then a bit of a car park relating to these units here. We've seen that Garden Studios occupy that one at the end. And this one here at the moment. And at the back we've got some porter cabins. We've seen some runners going from that side to the other. So it needs a lot of space doesn't it for this type of operation and if there is a fire <laughs> they'll be okay because right next door we've got the fire station look so we've seen the main part just there there's nobody out in the garden so there are no risks to people's safety off they go look <laughs> they know i'm a good guy so they're, they're not bothering anymore so we'll do what we normally do we'll get the whole site in one shot We'll do a 360 degree photo for Google Maps and then we'll see where the video takes us next because this has been an eventful one, hasn't it? Oh yes. I don't know why you think you're entitled to anything. I was uh, asking you a question. I was quite interested about the drone. You really think that you deserve any of my time? No worries. I was just asking. I wonder what drone it was. Oh. You really don't get the hint, do you? No. You're not welcome here, my friend. Welcome here. You're not welcome in my vicinity. In vicinity. I'm just going to ignore you. I was just asking about the drone. And I'm going to show people your true colours. Your true colours? Your behaviour right now. They're yeah, your true colours. I'm asking you about your drone. You don't want to be filmed in public, no? Yeah, the camera's coming out. If you don't want to be filmed, move out of the way, please. It's asking me not to film it. So, the gentleman that works for SRM, we've not managed to work out what SRM stands for just yet. can't quite see the frequency that is on on that radio <laughs> but look he's got a smile on his face now he's yeah, up there i've always got a smile here's up there you about your drone you won't tell me he wants to be the star of the show now look whatever you need to do buddy thank you we finally got there didn't we whatever you need to do anybody that's coming here just to make a video or looking around i just asked just you what leave drone them you're using. To it. don't do any of the stupid stuff that you've just been doing to me doing? 
you'll learn from this what have I been doing? and it will benefit the next person but I'm asking you what have I been doing so I can learn from it so you can tell you've me you've had your chance I'm asking you now you, you have what have I done no more of my airtime. what air have time. I done How old are you? Tell me. I think you need to grow up. No, mate. I'm asking you a question. What have I done? Look, I'm not in your space. Yeah, you know not to call in my not space. In your space. You Just know, you've learned that lesson, haven't you? No, I'm asking Don't you do question. it to anyone else that comes. All right. I'll do what I want. <laughs> yeah, clearly. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Tell me what drone it was. You've not got the hint yet. No, I keep going all day, mate. I've got nothing but time. That's what I'm asking would you. you what would you class it? it as harassment if you keep going all day? No. All right. Because you're doing it all day, so we can do it all day. I'm so doing what? Stand here all day and do this all day long. I'm doing what? And that's what I'm asking. What you. am I doing that offends you no. at the minute? I've asked you a question and you're not what answering me. What am I doing at the me, moment that I offends you? you? So I can keep asking. Now you're filming other people that are working. I'm, I'm trying to get some information. That's all. You know what I'm here for. Do you know what I'm here for? Do you give me your permission to film it? There you go, you haven't got his permission. I don't He's care. Nicely. Can give you it a rest, it, man. It's probably a cameraman. He knows what the score is out in public. Anybody can film anyone. He's asked you not to film him. There's no right to privacy in a public place. Yeah, Are you stupid or what? He's asked you not to film him. He doesn't want it personally. That's what I'm saying. Listen, if you keep following me, I'm going to class it as a rass man. There's your warning. Okay? That's what? I'm going back to work. Yeah, I think you should. I think you should. Yeah, I'm going back. Ah, they knew. <laughs> they knew the camera was coming. <laughs> oh dear. You lot are making it entertaining, that's for sure. I didn't hear what you said, mate, sorry. Go on, I can hear you now. No? Oh, okay. I thought you wanted to say something. You keep waiting till I walk away. Bye. So I'm not going to hang around with these clowns too long. I don't want to be seen to disrupting anything that they're, they're doing. We've come here to film. Are we going to be able to see what it says on that paper? No, he's not accidentally going to unroll it, is he? No. But it is nice to see that obviously this gentleman is obviously involved, so they're tidying all the, the paths. You know, if there's Go anything ahead. to take from it, they're Just keeping all the footpaths. The drone is down. The drone is down. It's still on lockdown, please. You're on me lockdown? Thank you. Are you really on lockdown because of me? Can anyone confirm that? Because that will help me uh, with my decision of when to leave. No? <laughs> See, you want to try and work with them, but you don't get no response. That's reasonable. All you get is unreasonable behaviour. But I'll give it five more minutes, and then I'm going to wrap this one up. I'll try and look for somewhere to hide the key ring, so that if anybody else does want to come down this road, I don't encourage you to, because who would want to get themselves involved in this sort of behaviour? Yeah. Now that is a question, isn't it? So let's see how discreet we can be. Hide this key ring. The DJ Audit's key ring location on this video is just in that bush just there. Yeah, you can see it just hanging down. It's across the road through the open gate. If you are one of the first people to watch the video and you do want a key ring, good luck with that. And that was Garden Studios here in, well, London somewhere. If you are not in the UK and you've got no idea what we're talking about with Big Brother, I'll give you a quick summary. Big Brother 2023 is the 20th series of Big Brother to air in the UK. It's the first series to air on ITV2 after ITV gained the rights to the series in August 22, almost four years since it last aired on Channel 5. Hi. Yeah, the drone's down now. Oh, is it down? Was okay. you the person that came originally? I was, yeah. It's a shame that you didn't stick around. 
because oh, it went right. downhill from there. Oh, why? Just my experience. But a video, Hello, Tony. A video from start to finish, my experience, I'll just show it to the viewers of what yeah. happened. And all I do is make videos of interesting places, that's all. Yeah. I just want to introduce you to Tamsin, who looks after Hello. the programme. Obviously, we've just got a duty of care to the people in the building. Everyone's feeling a little bit anxious and yeah. a little bit nervous about you being here. That's On that why note, everybody was asking. I just heard that you've locked down, right? Yeah. So since I've heard that, I've told my camera yeah. that I'm, I'm leaving within five minutes. Because I don't want to be an interruption. Yeah. I just want to innocently do my video from the outside on yeah. public land. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. No, no intention in of coming in. Drawn, where, where did you fly that? Because obviously that is private property. Yeah. And there are rules about where that can be flown. The drone, the important thing here is the weight. So it's 249 grams. So there's no minimum distances to commercial property. Bear in mind, I do this for a living on mm -hmm. YouTube. Mm -hmm. If it's heavier than 249, you have to stay 150 metres away from commercial buildings. Yeah, OK. That's the law. The, and maybe the, that's what you're referring to. Yeah, so the concern for us is when you normally do this, commercial buildings, as you said yourself, it's quite niche. Because of the nature of this being a television studio, it will get a lot more interest and a lot more pickup. That could be a real security breach for the staff and everybody that we're, that we're working with in that building. So for us, it is a real problem. It's not that we're trying to interrupt what you do and we really respect what you do, but this is a different situation to the types of buildings you would normally film. Now, bear in mind, I've, been, I've done police stations, I've done mm. MOD facilities. Mm. They've, got the, they've got the same concerns as you. Yeah. They say, Go if you publish this, it's a threat to national security even. So, and it's still got published and it's still not a crime. So the fact that I do my videos, there was nobody there in the gardens, so it couldn't have fell on anybody. It's no uh, safety issue. That's the main thing for me. Go is ahead. it safe to do what I'm doing? So if there's a crowd of people at a festival or something like Hello, that, are we I would on, never go um, over. And like I said to you, I highlight a few things yeah, all sure. the time. On, One of them is the badge. Uh, One of them is: Are you using uh, public frequencies for your comms? They really shouldn't be on public frequencies. Like people like me with simple Amazon scanners can pick your radio frequencies and we can hear what you're saying. I mean, if you need to be secure, you need to learn from what's happened today. Now, anybody could come. If somebody's got, if somebody wants to gain entry, right, like Ali, Do Ali Law did a few years ago, mm. and he made himself famous. His, his subscribers blew up, yeah? If somebody's got that in their mind, I want to copy him, then you need to look at what, what's possible. Use the drone footage, look at the comments, look, see what people say. Oh, that's an easy, that's an easy route here. Oh, let's tighten up that. You just need to learn from it. You'll never stop drones going over of 249 grand. Never. You just need to understand it is a thing of, of the times now people do it with, with prisons they drop drugs in and stuff like that prisons are having to deal with it yeah I, 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 I get all of that I do get all that I think it's when um, it's when you're doing a running commentary which I guess I know that's what you do but we've obviously got a, you know a, 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 a team that we've employed that are under our duty of care and then you're talking about and there's a runner going from that place to the other and like they didn't ask to be filmed that's okay. that's but, what but, i'm worried about yeah okay and garden studios have, have decided not only to use this site here yeah. but because it's, it's too big of an operation you need to use across the road that's not that's not us well the runner went from across the road across the road yeah so but, but we so i would say i would ask you really politely please don't follow that what, what don't include that footage well i just but that but that's my that's my that is my that's my main concern yeah and i'd like to reply you're, you're, they're filming people that haven't asked to be filmed yeah. and, talk, and doing a running commentary and this is what i'm getting at yeah, garden yeah. studios their employer whoever the employer is yeah, here yeah. i know you're just renting the space yeah. but they've decided that this guy some of his his operation is there and some of it's here so he needs to cross the public highway and there's no so expectation no, of privacy in a public place so there could be news reporters out here do you know the people that were filming the the, the um, King's coronation and it, they were beamed live everybody on the street was beamed live they might have supposed to have been at work and they just they bunked off you know yeah, but, so but they're getting people in trouble all the time if they're in public they're putting themselves on the camera but I think it's a decision to go to an event like that where you know it's going to be broadcast the nation mm. and just being at work and going for a coffee off the road he's he's working on Big Brother and he really within thinks it, no cameras private, are going to be outside on the road the it's not it's, a, it's the public highway. Do you know You know if you're of a site, say like if it was joined no and it was big the, enough. There's no interest in the people that work on Big Brother. You don't work on, I'm like, not working on Big Brother thinking taking, I'm going to be in the public highway. Yeah, if I, oh, I, 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 nowadays, I, okay, content so creation, I'm not going to be the first I'm, one to do this. I'm head of press. If I was bringing a housemate off the road, I 
fully understand the laws against paparazzi and everybody filming it, we would absolutely expect if we were bringing a house a bit over the road, mm -hmm. it would be fair game for everybody to photograph. Yeah. People who have a right to privacy and who are not in the public eye do not expect to be filmed. Well, it's, it's a decision for the data controller, right? So I'm collecting this data and if I feel that it meets the threshold to publish, it will get published. And at the moment, he's got himself involved in Big Brother and Big Brother have decided that a part of your working day is to cross this public highway. So who's at fault? You've, you've put half of his job over there and half of it over there. You're making him, you're asking him to cross the road where cameras, dash cams, probably cameras on the, the neighbouring businesses. I completely disagree with that. I know a lot about privacy law and I completely disagree with yeah? the so no, do, do you correct. believe do you believe there's an expectation of privacy in a public place? We did, do you know what? We didn't come here to get into uh, oh, yeah. We came oh, to appeal. I know, appeal. sorry, sorry, yeah. sorry. And all I'm to appeal saying is to please just think nature. about the people that are working under our duty care. That is all I've come out to yeah. ask you. When we you're, didn't know when if you're, you're publishing your content, I know what you're trying to do, I know what you're trying to get, and I totally get why you wanted the Big Brother house, but if you just could please think about the other people that haven't asked to be part of that, please just avoid that. That is all I've just come to ask. And I, okay. I would finish the conversation saying that the people that have behaved in a less professional manner today, if given the decision, they would also like to be excluded from the video. So if we give everybody the choice, would you like to be included or excluded? They're all gonna ask to be excluded. But I have to make a decision on whether it's right to publish their I, image. I, I, I know yeah? we've got no control over your footage. Yeah. So I'm just, I'm just coming out just to ask. Just, yep. you know, the, 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 just the kind of human, humane side of you, just to think about the people that we've employed. And that is all I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to go back in. Yeah, but, yeah, but please do. I'm, um, just, oh. I'm leaving now, so I'll be off. Thank I, you. I would make your comms a bit more secure. One of them is secure, one of them's not. Okay. I've heard diary room, I've heard where are you. But it's just stuff you don't want people to know. What's that? Mm -hmm. I'll tell you why I'm reluctant, because some people have actually shown a bit of aggression towards me and come in my personal space and I was very close to defending myself, right? Now, if these people get a head start where it's being published, complaints can go in sooner than they would normally happen. Now, the worst case scenario of a complaint for me is YouTube remove the video. So I'd rather it be removed after I've had a lot of views on it and got my financial reward from YouTube so that's why I'm reluctant to tell you where it's going because it will give him a head start to put in his complaint. You can't put in a complaint until a video is published anyway. So but it if, doesn't... if he's subscribed a notification bell on, as soon as I publish it, he'll put the complaint in within hours. It then shortens the amount of time my video is on there for me to earn my reward. If he sees it a few days later... Share it with me because I'm the head of press and I just want to have an I eye on it for I can't my... trust that your relationship with him is closer than I, I know, and you might tell him the channel, and give him a head start. If everybody was great, I've just been shown around one place. I've just been given a tour. The bloke says, I think I know what's going on here. This is my chance to actually promote the business. And I've just been given a tour. He got, he got all the information. He is subscribed already. Mm -hmm. But at the moment, it's not in my interest to tell you the channel, unfortunately. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Whew. Hope the next people to, hello. Hope the next people. Just don't publish it anywhere, GDPR applies. <laughs> so yes, I hope the next people to come and visit you guys, you have learnt something from today. Just keep your eyes on them. Do not do these silly intimidation tactics like you there did and you there did. The viewers will see what happened and hopefully people will have a much better experience next time. So I've heard you're on lockdown, so I'm going to make my exit now, guys. And I'll tell the viewers that if you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye bye for now.